All right, guys, so I plan on kicking this video out a lot sooner, but I had some other projects get in the way. Uh, what this video is going to be, it's going to be my opinions personally on uh, what I saw in the Battlefield 1 beta and also uh, what I think the Battlefield 1 is going to mean for the Hardcore League based on the beta. Now, since the beta has come out, uh, they released to us the maps and the game modes and things like that and uh, some fixes that they're going to be sending down the line. So we'll... Uh, We'll hit on those as well. Um, right out of the gate, I loved the game. I thought it looked amazing. I thought it played great. I thought the mechanics were beautiful. Um, I started on Battlefield Bad Company 2 as a sniper and uh, really enjoyed it. And this game kind of kind of brought me back to that. Uh, enjoyed Battlefield 3 and Battlefield 4, but they never they never had that feel that Battlefield Bad Company 2 did. And I think this game really brings that back it brings back the feel of battlefield back company 2 which i absolutely love so i'm super excited about the game i love the sniping in it um as you can see these are some of the clips that i got this in fact was uh my first round um with the battlefield one beta and then later on in the video you'll see some clips from some other rounds uh, i did a, i spent a lot of time running with my right hand man my son bruno 2.0 and uh, running some teamwork and it was a, it was a really good time really enjoyed the game like I said I liked the mechanics of it there were a couple things in the beginning that was difficult to deal with which were tanks tanks were really hard to deal with in the beginning because they took so many of those anti-tank grenades and there was unless you had another tank it was real difficult to take out tanks in the beginning of the game but as the game moved on um, as people started unlocking that uh, the anti-tank gun that you could carry around it got a little bit easier which dice has has said that the the light tanks were uh, overpowered and they were I, I had a hell of a run on a light tank because of it being overpowered them canister shells would just drop people from miles away um, but they are going to be fixing that and getting those light tanks back on par the the other thing that dice acknowledged and I, I saw it in the game as well was the amount of bullets that horses would take it was insane um they could have at least cosmetically put some armor on the horses to justify that i know if a horse goes down with one shot you know it'd be kind of useless to even have it in the game but at least they could cosmetically um explain why horses take so many bullets by putting armor or something on them i think that would uh that would definitely make it more tolerable but other than that, that, that was the only two gripes that I had about the game was uh, the tanks being OP and the, uh, the horses taking too many rounds. Other than that, I thought it was amazing, as I said. I think the teamwork that is built in, you know, follows the Battlefield franchise and, and each class, vehicles complement each other, things like that. Um, as we move forward with the with the hardcore league and Battlefield One, I'm super excited to see our teams compete uh, on, on Battlefield One. The tanks definitely require teamwork, especially those uh, those big tanks, the main battle tanks, because the driver no longer controls the main gun. You know, you've got two other drivers that are controlling the main gun, so there's got to be a lot of communication in between the drivers and the gunners to make sure that they're positioned right to take out other tanks and and enemies and things of that nature. So I'm really excited to see our teams prepare and compete in the new Battlefield 1. I think we're gonna have some amazing matches. I think some teams are gonna step up and I think that the game requires a lot of teamwork. So if your team just has got a bunch of good players but you don't have a lot of teamwork, I think you'll be beaten by teams that really emphasize teamwork and work on their teamwork uh, to win matches. So I'm super excited to get Battlefield 1 rolling on the Hardcore League and uh, see what happens. Now for the most part I played, I played the Recon class, the Sniper class, because that's, uh, that's my jam. But however, I, I played everything. I got on horses, I played every class, I got in every vehicle and tested out pretty much everything. And again, I like the way almost everything is balanced out. Obviously in the beta they didn't have hardcore mode, they only had core mode, so I'm real excited uh, when the game comes out to see hardcore mode and, and see how that operates and how that plays. Uh, but I'm optimistic, I think it's going to be really, really good and I'm looking forward to it. Um, again, in the air, planes, you know, you get one of those big planes and you can't keep that thing up very long if you're not using teamwork, if you don't have somebody on the guns to protect your... To protect your six and uh, and help 
hit targets down on the ground other than just dropping those bombs. Um, so again, the game incorporates a lot of teamwork and I'm, I'm looking forward to that. Like I said, I'm looking forward to seeing our teams uh, incorporate that teamwork and, and get things done as a team because it's, it's real hard to run solo on this as, uh, as I discovered several times. I mean, I did well. I got about 20 or so hours into it and I finished out at rank 50 something. I'm not sure. Um, I thought I did really well at the game. I had a blast playing it and uh, looking forward to it. I also think that the new maps, each map is going to bring different challenges into play. You know, we only saw this one on the beta here um, and the alpha. They, they had the other map, which I saw some footage of. I didn't get to play it. Um, but I think that the, that the different maps are also going to, our teams are going to need to incorporate different tactics for different maps. You're not going to be able to approach each map the same way, uh, just as, as Battlefield 4. So I'm, again, looking forward, man. Can't wait until it comes out and can't wait until our teams start competing in the Hardcore League and uh, getting some matches in. Looking forward to shoutcasting these things. It's going to be awesome. Um, obviously in the beta they didn't have a spectator mode uh, I imagine they're not going to remove that spectator mode though so we should we should be good on that end so to sum it up again I thought the game was great the mechanics the uh, oh my God. way Where the guns work the destruction the look of the game the vehicles yep, the teamwork parts. incorporated um, absolutely love it. the game that's my verdict um, that's what Dead Eye says about it I think it's great can't wait until it comes out and we get to play the full version and Got we get it. teams competing on it uh, but that's going to wrap it up for this video here um, I would have liked it to have been a little bit better but press for time just wanted to get something out there for you guys so that's where I'm going to leave it and uh, I'm going to let the rest of my clips go ahead and play out for you guys to see and uh, looking forward to the game coming out and I'll see you guys online I get more